With such a huge area to cover, every second counts. So the team has yet another bit of kit to step up the operation. So as well as the manpower and the dog and the little drone, they've also got something else in their arsenal. So this is a, a, a fixed wing drone. It just flies like an aeroplane, really. Can we come yeah, sure. Can I see how heavy yeah, it is? take a look. Wow. Underneath, uh, it's quite light. How about it weighs nothing? And how is this different to the other one that you've got flying around? Well, from a search point of view, yeah. we'd use it for a much more detailed search. So it'll fly over a certain area, taking photographs as it goes along. I, I believe this is more stable in windy conditions. And that's what the research is all about. Yeah, it's really fantastic. This is properly exciting stuff. The fixed wing drone is launched in a matter of seconds. 400 feet, still on a 40 knot override, 11.1 volts. Covering 370 acres in just 10 minutes, this eye in the sky is a great addition to any land-based search. I like that. <laughs> Perfect landing. Thank you. Fantastic. Right, should we get the memory card yeah, out let's now? Let's do that. The data from the memory card can take around an hour to download, but sending a team on foot to search the same area could take twice as long. At the control trailer, the hundreds of photos taken by the drone create a detailed image of the area. And I think we've found something. Right there. Yep, that looks like a tent to yeah, me. Yeah, absolutely. Yep. This is revolutionize what you do, surely. It does. It doesn't replace all our other assets, like members of the team who go out and search or search dogs. It's just another asset which might help us to find a missing person quicker.